How's everybody doing? <clears throat> That's kind of what I was talking about with the. There we are. Kind of see the, the angle and stuff there, but if you take it, you can see the ridge right up here, and I rest my thumb the crease right there and you can get over it and it kind of sits real nice in that and it's a little bit longer than the factory knob so you could actually put your thumb out a little bit further and since it does rotate it's got that little helical on it you can adjust kind of where your thumb sits in the groove and um yeah all in all super nice works really well the only thing that some people are going to complain about is if you look where the mounting hole is it's dead center of the knob so you can't adjust it distance wise like the factory one where it's offset so this right here the helical is going to be what you're going to be able to adjust really um yeah um it's pretty smooth actually um being that it is 3d printed out of some plastic you could stipple it and uh just with a little heat gun and touch it up and get a little bit of texture on there if you want um like a soldering iron just stipple it like you would a pistol grip or whatever uh I could see that being very beneficial, but I mean, it's, you got it right there in the groove and just a little bit of pressure on it and it goes. So all in all, super, super, super pleased with this and a very good investment. Um, they, they make a few different models. They make a knurled knob one. They have this one. I think this is the funky knob helix. And then they have a twister one that's a little bit thinner and actually has an arc in it. And I think that will actually be more beneficial for people that want to adjust it super close um, to the release itself or have it a little bit further out for someone that's got it way back here. If you want to bring it up closer, whatever it may be. But all in all, super awesome investment and I'm very pleased.